performer, only learned to speak English, only learned to speak English in his life, cannot speak any other language, which is interesting, which will be interesting once you see him. His piece is titled Autobiography. Please welcome to the stage, Paolo. Um, oh, okay. All right, so you already know my name is Paolo. Okay. So I wrote this poem as part of a literature class. And the prompt was, how would you want the world to see you? Right? If you could write a poem or whatever, then this is how... I'm sorry. Okay. My bad. Okay. Okay, I guess I'll get right into it. It's called Autobiography, and if there's anything I want you to take, it's this, about me. Okay. I was born in 1994 into a house with a roof and a floor, but I am homeless. Nowhere to point to and nowhere to return to. While my parents gave me life in the sands of Dubai, I grew up looking towards the sun and the sky. I have never stopped looking. I have only known the lands of Doha and Dubai, but I would not tell anyone that this is my homeland. I share the blood of all Filipinos, but I would not say that they are my people. I share the language of Americans, but I would not, but I would not say I belong to their culture. So I decided at the age of 15 to tell stories of the world I had yet to see. For my pen, for my tongue, and my pen proved invaluable. But not just because of that, but because I was uh, writing my own story. However, they held a greater importance. Stories were also a language. Even if I met someone who didn't know English by chance, there, there would never be a gap that I could not bridge because redemption, struggle, hope, these were all things that everyone knew. But in the end, this was just one way I could cope to help fight this feeling of hopelessness when there was nothing I could do. I have even looked for love for someone who would hear the stories of the world I would see someone I would point to, and someone to return to. I am young. I have not lived long. I have lived all of my years under a roof, celebrating every 30th of September on a warm floor. Unlike many people, I've had a home, but I am homeless. <laughs> 